Hey guys, welcome back for another bath bomb demo. Okay, I have this obviously incredible dinosaur to show you today. This is from Rock and Oil Naturals, and I've done her bath bombs before. The last one I did, I believe it was her Ziggy Stardust bomb, but this one is, I mean, it's crazy. It's incredible. Look at the colors, look at the shimmer. Look at that glass marbled eye. Okay, so she sculpted and cast this personally. This is oh, just, it's absolutely original. I've never seen anything like it. And it's absolutely huge. It's, it's bigger than my hand. You can see the thickness. I'm taking a chance doing all this with it. But I just need to show you guys just the detail on this, the size of it just the artistry in it, and just, I hope you can see how bright the colors are on this thing. It's absolutely insane. So I know this is gonna have super shimmery water. Let me go ahead and tell you that um, the scent on this one is cherry and ginger, but she also had another scent available. I think it was um, maybe like a sandalwood and oak moss kind of scent, but of course, you know, I'm gonna gravitate toward uh, the fruity scents, but. I know this is gonna give us some gorgeous bath art. It's just absolutely beautiful. Um, so I did order two and they were in the same scent and I have a feeling y'all, this is gonna be like Ziggy. I'm probably gonna turn around and order two more, but let's go ahead and get started. I can't wait to take this bath. I've already had my shower this morning. So right after I shoot this demo for you guys, I'm gonna hop right in and enjoy it. So like I said, let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys, so I thought I'd do something a little different with this demo. Before we get started, I wanted to let you guys know that these are the directions on the back of the bath bomb. This is the suggested method of how to actually do this bath bomb if you want to get, I would say maybe the optimum bath art. But since I did have two of these, I wanted to show you both ways you could do it. Um, it's funny, her tagline is, Throw this in your tub and soak it, which I think is awesome. So you could do that. You can put it in the tub and play with it, or you could do what um, I'm about to do, which is kind of put it in the bottom of the tub and go by the direction. So since I did have two, I thought I would show you both ways, and you could kind of decide how you want to do it for yourself, or just kind of compare and contrast the two different ways you could do it. So um, you can get different results with the same bath bomb depending on how you put it in your tub. So I just thought that I would kind of do something different with this one. So anyway, let me go ahead and get started, unwrap this one, and we will show some bath art.
Obviously, you can tell that it was beautiful. It made gorgeous bath art. It smells amazing in here. It smells kind of like, um, like a cherry slushy, kind of like, not quite a cherry Coke, but it definitely has some kind of, like an, like an effervescent kind of cherry scent, but it's not just cherry. I mean, I'm not sure quite what ginger smells like, but um, it definitely has more depth than just cherry. You probably can't tell how shimmery this water is because there's so much of a reflection on it, but um, I mean, it definitely has just tons and tons of luster in it. I can just get it to calm down for a second. You guys can see I'll try and snap a picture of it that's usually what works best for me um, my videos don't usually show shimmer very well but I'm gonna fish out that marble eye if I can without falling into the bathtub I think I know yeah about where it is oh it's so pretty and I did kind of request if she uh, still had this one left if I could get this one it's so pretty so this is definitely gonna be um, going in actually I keep all the little like treasures that come out of bath bombs and a little uh in one of the little cauldrons so anyway um but this is just a gorgeous gorgeous deep um like an emerald green with all kinds of gold shimmer in it so um let's go ahead and turn on the jets it looks like we'll probably get some bubbles hang on one sec All right, okay, now I think you can see what color that is. Now that I'm back a little farther away from the window, it is so, so pretty. And it smells really strong. Her scents are usually really nice and strong. And they're always blended so well. They're always, to me, they're always like a really kind of classic scent with a really nice pleasant twist, but they're really nice and strong too. They're just, well, they're not too strong. Sometimes too strong, like Lush is too strong for me a lot of times. But um, they're just really, just like the perfect strongness for somebody like me. Okay, we definitely have bubbles, but I'm gonna go ahead and cut them off so I'm not enveloped because I definitely wanna enjoy that green sparkly water. And I will let you guys know how it was when I'm done. Alright guys, so here is the end result of my Walk the Dinosaur bath bomb from Rock and Oil Naturals. And all I have left down in the bottom of the tub is some of that gold shimmer. There's a little bit of green mixed down in the bottom, but I just think that's just kind of that gold shimmer mixed with just a little bit of the green from the water. That around my tub, y'all, I think I'm just kind of getting like a residue, kind of like perma ring from all the bath bombs I do. Because my tub, y'all, it's like, um, like 14 years old now. I don't think that's this bath bomb per se or anything, but I absolutely loved, loved this bath bomb. Um... It's, the scent is lingering in my bathroom. It's lingering on my skin, and the water was absolutely gorgeous. So um, I will probably be trying to pick up a couple more of these if she does have them in stock by the time um, I am done or posted this demo. So I will have all of her links listed down below. I'm just becoming such a fan of hers. Every time she posts a new bath bomb, I just really think that she has outdone herself. So if you have not checked her out, definitely go ahead and um, check out her Instagram, check out her shop. She just has all kinds of amazing, unique, and original creations. So thanks for watching. I appreciate it, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.